After years of searching the forest, you have finally found the entrance to the room of the secret treasure. Once entered, the oracle, guardian of the forest and keeper of the ancient treasure appears in front of you. I saw this moment, the oracle tells you. The oracle can predict the future and is always right. The oracle shows you the two chests containing the treasure. He tells you that you can take one or both, your choice. The first chest is open and you can see it contains 1000 gold coins, while the second is closed and its contents are a mystery to you. The oracle forbids you from looking inside the second chest, but it tells you there are two options. If the oracle predicted that you'll take both chests, he has put nothing in the mystery chest. And if the oracle predicted that you'll take only the mystery chest, he has put 1 million gold coins in the chest. The oracle, who wants to have some fun, does not tell you what he predicted. What do you do then? Do you only take the mystery chest or do you take both? The correct choice is clear, don't you think? So clear that it makes you wonder why I'm even asking. Before we continue, pause the video and write both if you take both chests or mystery if you'd only take the mystery one. I'll count the comments and let you know what was the most popular choice. It's interesting to note that in a poll with over 35,000 participants conducted by The Guardian, 54% of people said that they would only take the mystery chest, while 46% say they would take both. Let's now try to understand the logic behind these two different points of view. If you said you would only take the mystery chest, your arguments should sound like this. The oracle perfectly predicts the future. If I were to take both chests, the oracle would have predicted this outcome, and it would have left the mystery chest empty. If I were to take only the mystery chest, the oracle would have predicted it, and it would have put 1 million coins in the mystery chest. So it's better for me to only take the mystery chest, right? If instead you chose to take both, your logic should sound like this. Once I find myself in front of the treasure, the oracle has already made his prediction. And it's either put 1 million coins in the chest, or is left it empty. Either way, the contents of the mystery chest cannot change. So in both cases, by taking both chests, I'll end up with an extra 1000 coins. Let's make a table to understand better. It's easy to see that by taking both chests, we end up with more coins in either case. Both ways of reasoning are rational but we reach two different conclusions by following two valid paths. This paradox is named after his creator, Professor William Newcomb, who proposed it for the first time in 1960. In the description you'll find a link to the poll conducted by The Guardian. I know what I would pick, but I'm not gonna tell you, I wanna know what you do. The video ends here. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like and comment. It's a small thing that really makes a difference. See you next time.